With you. I much just came here to clear my head. Oh, not this I hate this town crap again. You just gotta live life, man. Make it how you want it. I'm serious, there's a whole other place outside of Point Pleasant Beach. You know what's on the other side of this ocean? Europe. Disease. British people. Enough said. This isn't even the ocean. Doesn't matter. I don't want you to have any regrets. You know, some people spend their entire lives trying to leave this place and they just end up right where they started. I guess you're right. Still doesn't change the fact I can't stand this town though. Dude, you're just so depressed. You know, you have so many good things to be thankful for. Good friends, good family, bright future. You got a lot of shit going for you. You know, sometimes what I want to hear isn't exactly what I want to hear. I have this determination driven by my boredom to fly and get out of this place and do something great. So that's your problem. You're just bored and depressed. You have so much right in front of you and you never do anything about it. You know, let's go to a party. Let me take you to a party this weekend. No, that's not gonna happen. Not even if Sadie goes? Stop it, Nick. You need to, you're so depressing, you need to just stop. You know, I'm not depressed, I'm not sad, I'm just not happy. You're a lost cause. Do yourself a favor and start living in the now. Do you need a ride home? My mom wants me home early. No, I'm gonna stay here a little longer. All right, see you later. See you. Travis, you're late. Sorry, just came for lunch. Yeah. Yeah, okay, let's move on. All right, everybody, take out your books and turn to page 216. We're going to talk about the chemical properties of enzymes. No. Talking about enzymes on, today, there are four no. or several on. steps that I said no that uh, are involved in enzymes. Shut, start come with on. This is Travis. No. Travis, what's the problem? Sean forgot his book. No, Travis forgot his book, Mr. Callan. Just use your online textbook. Oh yeah, right. All right, let's pick up where we were. There's several parts to what goes on with the enzymes. One, here is the enzyme. Here is what's called the substrate. That's the thing that's going to be split by the enzyme. The enzyme in the substrate. You can have this at the end of the day. Think you could start a graph on Excel, Sadie? Oh no, that's okay. You can do it. Well, Mr. Callan took my laptop, so. Fine, I'll do it.
What's it called, Factor again? Oh, it's the molecule that attaches to the enzyme. It basically speeds up the reaction. How do you know that? Well, maybe if you brought your textbook, you would know. Oh, so that's how it is. So, do you have any plans tonight, Sadie? What? Oh, no. Why? Are you doing something fun? Oh, no. I was... Well... No, never mind. It was... It was stupid. No, no, go ahead. You were. I was wondering if maybe you wanted to... do something with me. Or... together, I mean. Or... I'd love to. Uh, great. What... What time should I pick you up? How about I'll meet you for dinner at around 5? Is Daniel's Bistro okay? Oh, yeah, sounds great. See you at 5 then. too excited about it though. She wasn't excited about it. She wouldn't have said yes. She's into you, I can tell. We'll, we'll find out tonight. Anyway, I gotta go to Mr. Callum's room. Gotta get my laptop. All right, tell me how tonight goes. Sure thing. Count? This wasn't supposed to happen. You think? 
What the hell is that lab? That, that liquid? I mean, tell me what the hell's going on. Yeah, calm down, Travis. It's gonna be all right. If you tell me to calm down one more time, it's... Okay, just tell me what the hell's going on. You've been exposed to something very powerful. Before I was a teacher, I worked for the military as, a, as the head chemist at a classified military research project called Project Flight. The goal of the project was to enable people to fly. We had hoped to create a league of angels, people to uh, rescue people, people to help other people, people to uh, try to create peace, not to wage war. But the military is only interested in war. They're not interested in peace. And when I realized that they were going to weaponize the serum, I took the serum and I took the research files and I fled. How have you not been caught all these years? I got rid of all the data they had on me and now I'm free. I I'm still really freaked out. Does, does this mean I'm going to sprout wings? Bird DNA was used as a basis of the serum, especially the proteins found in the feathers. The idea was literally to give man wings. Enhanced strength and senses were intended, but... But what? Well, there were several trials that were conducted to see how people, how humans, would tolerate the serum. But I could never get it just right. You're the only person who's lived through this. You're the only one who's ever survived having been exposed to this serum. How? I injected your cells with rovidium. My guess is it canceled out the effects of the serum. Rovidium? Yeah, rovidium is found in asteroids. It's the strongest metal that there is. This is a lot to take in. I just, I just wanted my laptop back. Well, you you're feel okay now, but the chances are you might relapse. What I'd like you to do is come in after school tomorrow and I can do some more tests. Your parents are probably worried about you. Get some rest and you should enjoy your date. Oh, you heard that, huh? But you know, you can't tell anyone what happened here, right, Travis? Yeah, I got you. Yeah, Travis. Yeah? There's your laptop right there. Oh, yeah, I'm fine. I just don't do this very often. What, eat dinner? No, take pretty girls out to dinner. Dude, what is wrong with you? I'm sorry, I've just been having a weird day. Yeah? Good weird or bad weird? It's definitely bad, but I don't know how bad yet. Well, if it helps at all, I'm glad that you asked me out. Yeah, that helps a little bit. Oh,
So, do you think I get a second date? I'd say you did good. Do you want to go for a walk on the beach? Sure. Go to a party. Everyone turns to see this beautiful lady. Is walking around with me. Uh, sir? Thanks again for dinner. It was really nice. Of course. It was my pleasure. So, have you thought about what you want to do after graduation? A little bit. I've always I've always wanted to be a pilot. Really anything to get me out of this town. Why? This place isn't so bad. I kind of like it. The people are nice. It's safe. Well, I mean, it's pretty boring. Nothing really goes on here. Well, instead of dwelling on how boring it is, maybe you could work to make it better? Okay, smart and beautiful. Yeah, yeah, I'll shut up. No, I should really focus on what's in front of me. Beautiful smile, whole package and everything. Yeah, that's him. You'll have your serum soon enough. report. I found Callan. He's been living in a small beach town. Good. And what of this boy, Finch? I will continue to track him. He may know something. All my experimentation I've been through, all the killings I've done, and every mission means nothing if we don't get Callan. Daniel, you are doing your country a great service. We're gonna stop the danger before it begins. The serum will be yours. Callan, Callan will suffer. We will prevail. Come on. Come on, what you gonna do? What you doing, gonna do? Leave him alone, John. Get out of here, Travis, before I break you. Ben, run. Hey, Travis, what's going on? Oh, what's going on? No, nothing really. Just, just, you know, uh, metal wings popping out of my freaking okay, arms. Okay, okay, calm down, calm down. Just tell me what happened. It, it was in the hallway, and there was a fight. It, it all happened so fast. It was wings popping in my arm. It was like a bird. I don't know. Mr. Count, I'm freaking out. I'm freaking out. All right, listen, you're going to be okay. You're going to be all right. Just tell me, can I see the wings? Okay. Wow, this is astonishing. The Ravidium must have bonded with your cells and counteracted any of the toxins in the serum. Yeah, it's super cool. Now, can you fix it? 
I'm sorry. There's nothing I can do. Come on. There has to be something you can do. Cut them off. I don't care. Fix me. Travis, they're made to be indestructible. I can't... I can't be a freak for the rest of my life. You may be a freak, but you're a freak with an amazing gift. You can do good in the world. I don't want this gift. I just want to live a normal life. Travis, I've known you for three years, and I know that you crave adventure. That's why you act out in class. You're bored. But you have an opportunity to do good in the world, to do good things. And that opportunity is at your door. Can you really walk away from that? Are you saying I should be a superhero? You can help the helpless. You can protect people. You can give people something to aspire to. You need to see the good in everything and exploit it. And if that means you have to be a hero, then that's just the way that it is. You're crazy, you know that? I know. General. At ease. Sir, I have news to report. What is it? It would be better if you saw it yourself. Well, those complicates things. It seems the boy, Finch, has ingested the serum. We will need to retrieve him. No. We'll need to come up with a new plan. But, sir. That's an order. <sighs> yes, sir. I'm going to teach you to use your power in the most effective ways possible. You'll have full control of your abilities, and flying will be second nature to you. Are you ready? I'll give it a shot. All right, I'll take it. Do I have to wear this? Yes. But it's itchy. Do you want to keep ripping your shirts? Fine. How do I do this? Up, up, and away? To infinity and beyond? Just jump. This just jumped. You all right? You okay? I can't do this. What are you talking about? You just flew. It's fantastic. I just can't do this, Mr. Cal. Travis, you've given me something that I've missed for a long time. Hope. Hope that maybe my life's work wasn't for nothing. Hope that you can bring the same feeling to anyone, to everyone who needs it. That's what the Garnet Gull was meant to do. That's what Travis Finch was meant to do. I think the serum has side effects. I have this insustainable craving for crab legs. Well, that's hilarious, but it's not surprising. Uh, I think your body's just adapting to the changes caused by the serum. When do I get to start punching people? Wait, listen, you're not supposed to be punching people. The job is to inspire people. Yeah, yeah, I know. Rescuer, not a fighter. Right, so just don't go looking for a fight. No, 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 no. Here, just take this. Is this the suit? It's, it's the suit, isn't go, it? Go, go, just go. God, 
You should have kept the boy out of this, Bob. This isn't you, Garn. I know you. This is what you made me. I didn't do this to you intentionally. I admit, mistakes were made. When I was a child, I was haunted by a creature called the Raub Tear. The thought of this monstrous predator whose only purpose was to destroy me. Your experiments, your mistakes, turned me into the monster I am today. I am your Raub Tear. You didn't drink that formula, did you? Daniel? Daniel Garn is dead. There is only the Raub Tear. You're not capable of hurting innocent kids. You have no idea what I'm capable of. I will destroy you and that oversized rat with wings you call a hero. That's the garden goal of you, Roid Rage. You think you can stop me, Finch? I was made to destroy you. <laughs> You thought you could be a hero? What makes you so special? I'm just a kid with wings. Spandex. It's a long story. Welcome to Channel 87 News. I'm James Waverly. Yesterday, Point Pleasant Beach High School was attacked by a large masked armored man. Thankfully, there was only one injury and he is expected to make a full recovery. Authorities say it could have been much worse without the intervention of a red and white winged man that people are now calling the Garnet Gull. Many eyewitnesses are baffled at what they just saw. I was walking my dog, Rufus, and all of a sudden there was this big guy yelling at some kid in red spandex with wings. It was crazy. This guy had metal wings coming out of his arms. The beak was a little weird, but still the coolest thing I've ever seen. I was so scared, I didn't even know what was going on. And what would you think of the Garnet Call? I think he's kind of hot. <laughs> no one seems to know exactly what happened. One thing is clear. Everyone would like to know the answer to one question. Who is the Garnet Gull? Thank you, and have a good day. There's no way you're the Garnet Gull. I promise you, I'm telling the truth. Okay, fine. Prove it. Oh my god, no way that's real. You're the Garnet Gull! I know, I told you. That's insane. I can't believe this. It's crazy, I know. So what now? You fly around to save the world? Something like that.
You've been out of the game for a while now. You're dangerous. But that's why we want you on our side. To help our people do their jobs. The world is in peril. And they might be the only ones who can save it. You didn't think the girl was the only one, did you?